Welcome to the Coach's Show. Well, it's that time of year in football, bowl season. We're excited at european.football.us. So kick back and enjoy the bowl season. Get out the party wings, the beer, your favorite seasonal drink, and watch some football, baby. I'm your host, John Anderson. And today on the show, I'm going to be give out a few congratulations and discuss the upcoming bowls. All right, thank you for joining me today. Uh, don't party too hard tonight. Have a good time. Uh, first of all, the congratulations I wanted to talk about. Uh, tops on my list was my undergraduate alumni, the Langston Lions offense, on their 2016 achievements for national NAIA rankings. They had a great offense this year. Of course, can't leave out Oklahoma State Cowboys with their 38-8 victory over Colorado. Another uh, Big 12 uh, team worth mentioning is Baylor, who handed Boise State a 31-12 uh, victory. What can you say about those Bears, except they can play some football, baby. And I was glad to see them. Glad about the Big 12. Uh, I'm going to take... Uh, I'm going to go with the Air Force over uh, South Alabama. I think they're just too strong, too fast. I like Air Force uh, in the game that they play. Seen them over the years. Watched them a couple times in the Military Bowl in Fort Worth. Enjoyed those games. So I believe our Arizona uh, Air Force, I'm sorry, is going to do their thing again. All right, let's start with the Orange Bowl. I like Michigan's defense over Florida State's offense. I love Michigan's defense. I think they got a great defense. They got, a great senior group, and they're going to play real well. I watched them in the Ohio uh, State game. Uh, their defense stood out, and I, I just don't think that uh, Florida State can match it. Uh, in the Citrus Bowl, I'm going to take Louisville over LSU. I don't think LSU's defense can stop Lamar Jackson. What can you say? He's a Heisman Trophy winner. Now, if you're a betting man and you believe in uh, jinxes, in the past, the Heisman Trophy candidate or uh, sorry recipient uh, has never fared well in their bowl game. So we can check out that and see what happens. Okay, now let's talk about the real games that everybody's uh, concerned about. The, the championship game, I'm happy to see that Washington uh, finally got to the respect that they deserve. But frankly, I just don't believe they can handle Alabama's defense or their offense. Uh, they are true underdogs in this situation and in this game. And I think it's going to be a tune-up game for Alabama uh, to move on to the championship game. Now, in the Fiesta Bowl, I believe this is a toss-up. Toss Both teams' offenses have struggled during the season. But I like Clemson's defense, and I believe they can push past Ohio State. In my opinion, I believe Penn State should have been playing this game. But, hey. That's just my opinion. But I do like Clemson's defense, and I like the way they played all year. In the Rose Bowl, I'm going to go with Penn State over USC. I just believe that the Pac-12 is truly overrated, and they're going to come up against a true tough defense who is able to hold Ohio State down and, and be able to pull out a victory in overtime. All right. Now, finally... We're going to get to the real game that I'm enjoying, the game that I would stay up late to watch here in Europe. It'd come on about 2.30, maybe 3.30 in the morning. Uh, this is the one I will be screaming and, and hollering about. For sure, my entire family has to stay up and watch this game. They have to put on their OU gear as usual uh, so we can cheer for those Sooners against the Auburn Tigers. Honestly. My only concern is of OU's defense, can they slow down the Auburn's offense? And on the other hand, how many points can we put up against a good Auburn defense? So my prediction, I'm going with OU. I got my hat on, sending my shouts out to, to those Sooners. If you're an international football fan, then check us out at www.euroamericanfootball.us. We'll be coming to your computer soon, 
and in your home. Thank you for having us. Thank you for listening. Appreciate it. And I'm going to let Nelly take us out of here. Love this song. Oh. Yeah. I love it when Ray Lewis used to dance to this. He turned me on to it, but I can't dance like Ray Lewis. Thank you for watching The Culture Show, and have a happy new year. Be safe out there.